slap him. YKTV was popping, Louis V was popping, Troy Wright Jr. was popping, Industry TV was popping, Story of Thomas was really good, Rambo 79 was populating, Darnell Williams was popping, Brother Grimm was popping, was really good. I don't know why I'm getting comfortable, man, because my phone is dumb low. Let me try to turn my brightness down some right quick. Got to turn the briggity down right quick, man, because this shit going to die me. You heard, but that new episode is dropping at 10 o'clock. That's a fact. Now I'm straining my eyes. Yeah, that new episode is dropping. At 10 o'clock, new LAZ episode, new story of Pottersfield. You feel me? So, you know, for the five niggas out there who still give a fuck about my rap career, make sure y'all tune in. You're Ersk. Because this is exclusive, baby. This is exclusive, baby. You heard? Slim Blunt gang in the building. If you're a legal grower out there, you got your illegal weed dis distribution business, holla at me so we can make a couple of million together. You heard? Holla at me before I make my own strand. Shout out to the bro forever fresh. You heard I just bumped into the bro in the streets, now I mean Gen Pop Rapper, the bro forever fresh, man. Shout out to the bro, shout out to the whole Dykeman 200 block. You heard? The people is in these streets, baby. They in these streets, baby. They in these streets, baby. All right, man, I gotta turn this brightness back up because I don't know what's going on. D. Joseph was really good. Romy 16 was populating. Alberto Cabrera was really good. Hood TMZ, what up? Randall Henshu was popping. Hussan Salam was really good. Greg Johnson was populating. See y'all in the building. Yerk. Darius M was really good. Jim Pop, you're Ray Snow. Keto, what up? I gotta start, I gotta get out the habit of walking on these crates. I'm um, these crates in New York, man. They could be risking his life walking on them shits. Every time I get on live, my slim blunt start acting up, man. Word up, man. CT in the building, what up? You already snowstorm warning. You heard? You already snowstorm warning. You already snowshoes. He's <laughs> <coughs> about the best. It's really good though. Yeah, that new episode dropping at 10 cash. You feel what I'm saying? Be there, be square. You know what I mean? Story of Potters, I'm talking about the first real song I had on radio and the craze that it caused in my life. You're no 
still some it's still some real hip hop fans out there that still love real hip hop, man. They out there, man. You feel what I'm saying? And the ill shit about telling the story of Pottersfield shit is, you know, when a nigga feel like he ain't do enough in the game, when I listen to these stories or when I tell these stories, I realize I did do a lot of shit. You feel what I'm saying? When you think back, you actually did put in some work. You heard so. A nigga gotta appreciate the grind. That's the best part of the shit, like, you feel me? Nigga be wanting that success. But when you even when you get that success, you miss the grind. You're gonna miss the grind. I love this Nautilus, like, check it. This Lincoln Nautilus is small, but I love it though, look. That shit is hard, man. That Nautilus. Dirt. Them niggas designed the shit out of that shit. They designed the shit out that Nautilus, baby. And that's a flaxation. I ain't get, yo, straight up, I fell asleep mad early yesterday. I don't even remember what time I fell asleep dumb early. And then I woke up at like one in the morning and I ain't go back to sleep since. You heard? So I, I fucked my whole sleep pattern up. When I do crash, it's going to be a monster crash. You heard? I fucked my whole sleep pattern up. But, um, I put in work, man. I, did, I, I edited three episodes. I woke up and I edited three episodes. I got one that's dropping right now and I got two more locked and loaded. You feel what I'm saying? So, I'm happy I, I'm happy I did that. You know what I mean, I put in some heavy twerk in the middle of the night put in a quick little five six hours of editing right quick in the middle of the night got them two episodes up there give me some some breathing room you feel what i'm saying screed up murphy law media was popping feelings too was popping gaming with tuck was really good shea butter was populating Jason Murph, I see you in the building. What's really? Yeah, that new slap is coming on. You know, there's certain blocks you could go on in New York, in Manhattan. There's certain blocks you go on. Yeah, you feel what I'm saying? Niggas be looking at you funny. You heard? Niggas be looking at you funny. I be looking at niggas back like. Fuck is you looking at, nigga? You heard? Fuck is you looking at? Straight up. Niggas be giving you the look like, what are you doing on this block? I'm walking on this fucking block, nigga. Stop worrying about what the fuck I'm doing on your block. Worry about what the fuck you doing hurt with your motherfucking gold fuck out of here with your gold handrails you feel me niggas see you walking past they gold handrails niggas be looking at you like what are you doing over here fuck you looking at nigga fuck you looking at nigga Yerk. told you man I'll come on your gentrified ass rich block and you'll hear words like Fruit. I'll be on here. I'll be on here saying the word fruit. Mad motherfucking loud. Know what I mean? Y'all niggas will be confused. Like, what the fuck is that? What is that sound I keep hearing in the middle of the night? Bird. I told you <laughs> I got an idea for a movie, man. I got an idea for a movie called Gentrified. Right? I got an idea for a movie called Gentrified. I don't want to give it up, nigga, because y'all going to start saying, I'm telling my ideas and somebody going to bite. And niggas do be biting ideas, man. So I'm going to stop telling ideas. But I got an idea for a movie called Gentrified. That shit funny as a motherfucker. You heard? I got to sit my ass down and start really writing the script, though. But I got a funny-ass movie. 
funny ass movie, nigga. Dirt. Niggas gonna be bringing niggas, niggas gonna be bringing niggas eight deep to play dice on niggas block, you heard? Straight up. That niggas think y'all live in a gentrified, nice neighborhood. Four in the morning, we gonna be out there rolling CeeLo. Having a couple of good shootouts on your block, nigga, on York Avenue. You feel what I'm saying? Have a couple of shootouts on York Avenue on your block right quick. I mean, a couple of dice game scraps. A couple of good dice game robberies. Damn, look how close this nigga is to my shit. Niggas be like, niggas IQ game be low, man. Like, niggas IQ game be low, bro. Like, damn, my nigga. Kind of uncomfortably close to this car, my brother. Yeah, kind of, man. When is it? When is a rental is uncomfortably close? All right, nigga. No, I got the rental out here, man. Don't, don't scratch, don't scratch the motherfucking rental up, nigga. Niggas already unscratched the piece up. Don't scratch the rental up too. You feel what I'm saying? Hurt? Right. Niggas already done putting that hate work on my, on the Audi. Niggas already put that hate work in. I can't take no more. I can't take no accidental hate now. The on purpose hate already done put that work in on me. Word is Bon Jovell. But yeah, that new episode is dropping in 20 minutes, man. I don't know if my phone is going to last 20 minutes, though, and I don't feel like sitting in no car. Gert. Jimmy Olive, what's on? DeAndre Crosby, what's popping? Yeah, my genies. Don Weezy, what's populating? I see you in the building. Yeah, damn, how could I resist sitting on this? This is perfect. I know niggas be sitting on here loitering all day. Damn. But yeah, man. 80s baby was popping. Resurrected was probably grand finale, but up. But yeah, man, I ain't getting no real sleep, man. So I'm running on fumes right now. You feel what I'm saying? But um, I had to put some, I had to put some overnight twerking, load up a good three episodes. You feel what I'm saying? Those ready to blast off. Yersk. So we getting it in, man. We getting it in. Word up. Yeah, it's a lot of controversy online right now, man. You heard? I'm trying to stay, I'm trying to stay, I'm staying clear of the controversy and trying to stay in 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 bat in the bag's way. You heard? I'm trying to avoid the controversy and stay where the bag is at. If it ain't no bag in the controversy, we ain't doing it, my nigga. You heard? Hurt. Bagastinos, nigga. That's that's my AKA, nigga. Bagastinos, you heard? That's my new AKA. So when you hear me say that, you know I'm talking about Z Boy. And I say, listen, nigga. Bagastinos, nigga. That's all I'm concentrated on right now. How you doing? Yeah, my nigga. Word, nigga. Bag of Ellie to dawn, man. Same bag. Damn, my 
dude. Damn. You swinging that navigator like a wild baboon. Damn. Damn. These chicks, like, these chicks, I'm going to keep it real with you, bro. These chicks be like 5, 4, 11, driving a motherfucking navigator. You heard? Niggas be 4, 11, driving a navigator, doing 60 on the local street. Like, bitch, a wild young man. I'm gonna tell y'all a secret. I'm gonna give y'all a secret, man, because you know what I mean? We a family with this gem pop shit, so I'm gonna give y'all a jewel, man. This is a jewel, you know what I mean? Now, you don't overread into this. You don't overread into this jewel, but I'm just gonna give you a jewel. If, if, if every time you look at a certain chick, if she fixes her hair or fixes her clothes, every time you look at her, she likes you. Now, that don't mean she wants to leave her husband and kids for you. It just means you, you, you're attractive to her. And, you know, under the right circumstances, she may holler. You feel what I'm saying? Or wish she could holler. But if you look at a chick and every time you look at her, she fix her hair or her clothes, you halfway there, bro. Now, if you look at a chick and she don't fix nothing, she just look at you and that's it. Most likely, she's not interested in you, bro, because if she was interested in you, when you look at her, you, she'll get slightly uncomfortable for one second, and she'll fix herself to make sure she's looking at her best. Unconsciously. You feel what I'm saying? She'll just fix her hair. So keep that in mind with your girl, too, nigga. When you, if, you, if you walking down the street with your girl, and every time a nigga, a certain nigga walk by and look at her, she fixing shit, you let that be known. Like, yo, why you keep fixing shit? Every time that nigga come through, what's poppin'? You like that nigga? I call that shit right out. You feel what I'm saying? So I'm just giving y'all my little pimp pimpologies, pimpology 101, man. You heard? Word mother. Nah, I don't know the bro, bro. Cino 3000, what's poppin'? Yeah, bro. But that's like though. Word, that St. Bags is hard, nigga. St. Bags, a.k.a. Bagostinos, you heard? Damn, my phone is about to die, man. My shit gonna die. I ain't sitting in no car. But, yo, that new episode is dropping at 10 o'clock. That's in 15 minutes. I might log back on right quick before...